Good morning to you. It's uh, about 9.30 on this uh, Tuesday morning. Just finished looking at everything. I don't have too many changes in the forecast. Here's what's going on. By the way, real quick, didn't get as cold as I thought it would this morning. Mother Nature fooled me a little bit. So because of that, there might be a red X on the forecast check tonight for the first time in over a week. So uh, tell your friends to check in. And if there is that X, the box will appear. You can enter your email and be in a drawing for $50 to be a cash winner. That drawing takes place on uh, Saturday. All right, for the rest of today. Not sure if we get some sun or not. If you look at the visible satellite picture, this is mostly just valley fog right now. So we might get a, a peak of the sun, but clouds will be increasing this afternoon as the jet stream starts to come in. And then that disturbance, which will bring us some passing rain, looks like it actually crosses us about 10 o'clock tonight. Now, you typically you get the best chance of rain ahead of that. So that would be 8, 9 o'clock before that thing rolls in. So if you're out and about, um, yeah, you know, I wouldn't be shocked if we start to see some light rain develop in spots as early as 4 o'clock today because of the jet stream that's going to precede that disturbance coming in. But clearly, if you're out and about this evening, uh, up through 10 o'clock, the better and better and better the chance of rain will become. Doesn't look like a lot. I still think totals will average less than 15 one hundredths of an inch, but most of us will get something. Maybe a lingering shower in the morning. I don't think so, but I'm going to leave that in the forecast. And then tomorrow during the day, clears out. It could be flat out sunny before Wednesday finishes. So how about that? All right, have a great rest of the day, and I will talk to you soon.